All right, what I would like to do is demonstrate uh, Fluvio data. So we're going to create uh, a new Linode. I want to make it a um, Ubuntu 22. Go We'll just do whatever's here. Shared. Make it like two. Could probably even work on one, actually. Let's try it on one. say demo. So what we want to do is um, we want to work against the uh, the Kubernetes cluster here. Okay, so we'll need this YAML file, this kubeconfig. This is download blocked. Let's allow that. So what we need to do is install kubectl and helm. So let's do kubectl first. Let's, uh, let's see what... So I believe it's jammy. Oh gosh, what happened? Install kubectl. Oh, oh, oh. What's happening? What's happening? Here, let's clear this. Okay. Run. Oh, run. Oh, gosh. Okay. Let's get rid of that. Okay. Copy. Okay. Never mind. We don't want that. Okay. There we go. Okay. So. Let's find out which cube cuddle. All right, cube cuddle version. All right. Okay. Let's install Helm. Say Helm version. Okay. And then we're going to um, ls. Okay. Let's move Linode Linode test to just. Uh, cubeconfig.yaml. Okay. Now we'll say export kubeconfig to that, and then we'll say kubectl get node o wide. All right. So that's this is is refers to that then. Okay. So we can just kind of double check this. LKE, yeah. All right. Okay. So we've got our cube config set up so that um, we can run against this cluster here.
on this on this new uh, Linode. Okay, now we want to install the Fluvio CLI. Now we're going to install the Fluvio CLI. Okay, and then we'll have to. Uh, pretty sure it did that. Oh no. I think it. I think I tried to do that. We'll see if it's there. Let's say cat bash rc path. Okay, so we'll say which Fluvio. Let's say source. Fluvio CLI installed with the cube cuddle and helm so that we can create local clusters. So let's go ahead and uh, do all these checks here. All right, all checks passed. Now let's create our cloud profile so that we can um, So we'll say Fluvio profile list. We should just have the cloud one. We, should, we need a local one that, as well. So, excuse me. Um, in order to create a, see, um, uh, in order to create a, a cloud, an Infineon cloud profile, we had to authenticate and then it created automatically. In order to create a local profile, we'll have to create a cluster locally, and then it'll just automatically do it. And then we'll switch over if it's not. Okay, so let's run locally. Okay. I just noticed in my notes here, I have that kind of out of order. Well, maybe I do, or maybe I don't, I don't know. Okay, so let's say um, Fluvio cluster start local. And see what, what we get here. Okay, um, let's say Fluvio cluster delete. Uh, probably could say local, but uh, uh, local. Okay, so let's say Fluvio cluster start local. So now we're running against, oh, let's see, Fluvio profile list. Okay, so now we're on the local profile because we created a local cluster. It's actually local in the sense that it's not in Finion Cloud, it's still remote. But yeah, we're managing it locally. Okay, so let's produce a topic for this. So we'll say, um, well, actually, let's just, let's just, well, okay, no, no, let's just, let's create a topic. Let's create a topic. Okay. Um, Fluvio, okay. Local list and switch uh, in, I'll just copy. Go back to local. Our local. Okay. So let's create a topic. Let's say we have a topic create greetings local. Uh, let, let's say Google's local demo. Okay. And then we'll say echo uh, greetings local demo. Pipe that to Fluvio produce function 
and the topic is greetings Zorbo Demo. Okay, we'll just produce that topic. Now let's listen for anything that, so that one in the pipe, it's basically like a message. It's not a message queue, because that's something where you like have to retrieve it manually. It's a, it's a, uh, it's a, it's a, um, a topic, which is something that uh, runs based on an observable, like a subscription, pops up. All right, so let's say Fluvio consume Greetings local demo. And so let's consume the topic with the flag, capital B, which I forgot what that means, and lowercase d. I forgot which both they mean. But greetings local demo is, is what we got back. I guess that's what uh, that's what we produced. Let's produce some more text text echo. Um, yes, hello. Yes, hello. This is dog. Um, and we'll, we'll echo that, pipe that to produce function to the topic of greetings local demo. Oh, oh, oh. Fluvio, oh. what did I say? Echo. What did I, what did I do? What did I do? Okay, echo, da, 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 pipe, Fluvio produce, right? Okay, I just said produce. I meant Fluvio produce, excuse me. Fluvio produce. Okay, now let's say Fluvio consume. Uh, this topic. Let's just see what we get from it. Oh, okay. Consuming records from. So that'll be listening for any new subsequent wins. Okay, so let's control C out of that. Okay. Like capital B, lowercase d. Okay, yes, hello, this is dog. Okay. Now, that was a local, right? So let's say Fluvio profile list. Uh, local, okay. Let's say Fluvio profile switch. Uh, in fin yawn dash cloud and then this list cloud okay so let's create a topic let's do the exact same thing except uh, topic creating uh, not local demo greetings cloud demo it would be better if we said greetings demo Cloud that way when we switch cloud and local and but anyway that's uh, that's that's you know uh, create that topic okay well, let's produce to the topic so um, echo um, yes hello this is dog producing to cloud topic okay pipe that to fluvio pro fluvio produce Greetings, demo cloud. Okay, now let's say Fluvio consume greetings demo cloud topic and ca capital uh, dash uh, capital B dash lowercase d hyphen hyphen that's what it is hyphen. Yes, hello, this is dog producing the cloud topic. Okay, so <clears throat> we created a local cluster. And um, and produced and consumed uh, against those topics, and then we did to the Infineon cloud, and we did switch back and forth, so we can do this. And actually, you can have many clusters as you want, but there's really no point in like going much further than that at this point. That's just how to get everything set up, and then we can get more into like the the nitty gritty of like programming and Rust and creating modules to do extract, transform, and load. Yeah, baby.